Janine Perry, you already saw our host of Justice with Judge Janine and author of the new book, great new book, Liars, Leakers, and That's Tables. right, and she, w she was over on The View yesterday to promote <laughs> it. Uh, how did it go? Watch this. Do you think he is an ideologue that is faithful to conservative policies? You know, I'm not here to talk about what Donald Trump is and isn't. But you I mean, I about it. No, you got no, to answer I'm the question. I'm here to talk you about the okay. You want to talk about Donald Trump, you tell me what metric in this country is worse off. Unemployment is lower than it's been in 50 years. Minorities, Hispanics, African Americans have jobs. Hate, 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 hate crimes are worse and off. And wait a minute, the GDP under Obama was barely one. We're going up to four. So you want to talk about no, hate yeah, crime? I'll tell you I about fought metric, for a law I, for hate crime. I also you, think it's important, as we said, 89% of the Republican Party still supports him. He still has huge popularity in the country. And if Democrats don't get their you know what together, he's certainly going well, to get reelected. Here's my question. You know, for, here's my question for you because Trump you talk about you, you talk about I am not judge. nobody no, is I, no, oh yeah did you just point at me yeah listen I don't have Trump oh, derangement let me tell you what I have okay. I have a lot of I'm tired of people starting a conversation with Mexicans or liars and rapists I'm tired of people starting a conversation about this country listen I'm 62 years old. There have been a lot of people in office that I didn't agree with, but I have never, ever seen anything like this. I've never seen anybody whip up such hate. I've never seen anybody be so dismissive. And I... And clearly you don't watch the show, so you don't know that I don't suffer from that. What I suffer from is the inability to figure out how to fix this. That's my issue. But one of the things that you talk about a lot, and I'm curious about it, is the deep state. How long has the deep state been there, and who's running it? Well, the, the, I want to answer your question, because you get... I you had to ask no, you a question. You had I, your I, opening I, statement, which was how horrible it is that Donald Trump no, is talking no, no, about all you, of these I'm people. Sorry, you know baby, what that's I think what you is horrible? Said, you said, well, but you know you what's said horrible? That it, when it people was, who it's shouldn't okay. be here end it's, up murdering the children of American citizens. You know what's horrible? What's when, horrible when the president of the United States whips up people to beat the hell out of people. No. Say goodbye. Let me Say goodbye, and uh, then on the other side of that timeout, uh, Judge Janine was no longer in that chair. <laughs> what happened? Okay, so I'm invited to The View to talk about my new book, Liars, Leakers, and Liberals, The Case Against the Anti-Trump Conspiracy. And, you know, my uh, the, the publisher said, do you want to go to The View? I said, of course I'll go to The View. I like Whoopi. I, really, I like them. I, mean, I have no problem talking about my book. So I go there, and, uh, you know, the first segment was relatively calm. And, you know, I got the transcript. And one of the things I said was, um, uh, one of the things we need now, we need people to talk to people who ostensibly hate each other. It's time we sat down and had a conversation. And Whoopi, you know, interrupted and said, now? Oh, I'm so glad. But anyway, that was almost prescient. Uh, the second segment, after some small talk, I mean, we had, you know, I was making small talk. I was, you know, happy uh, to discuss a book. my a book. Right? And then we came back and it was, you know, no holds barred. Uh, Whoopi got angry. And what, what the viewing audience, the television audience didn't see is that they, they popped up the cover of my book as she pushed off the desk, you know, unplugged her uh, uh, her mic, and then stormed off the set. So I'm there saying, you know, I'm in television. I said, I don't think the segment's over, but I think she just left, Janine. I think it's over. So I take off my own mic, and then I, you have to go down the stairs. Mm -hmm. I go down the stairs, and she's right there. And I said something like, Whoopi, you know, I spent my whole life fighting for victims because we had talked about rapes and all that. And she said to me, as she, she got up in my face and I read somewhere someone said well she you should have kept walking I couldn't walk by her she was at the bottom of the stairs she says F you F you and then I, I said did you just say F you and then she said get that F out of this building, get the F out of this building. So I'm there and I'm like, uh, okay. And you didn't do anything to provoke anybody there? No, 
know. You can ask the people that I was with. I mean, she she was nuts going off the uh, uh, the set, and then when I walked down, and so as I started walking out the building, so this woman is yelling behind me, "Get the f out of this building!" I mean, look, I, I've I've been a prosecutor, judge, DA for thirty years. I try murder cases. I can go toe to toe with anybody, but that was abuse, and it was sad. It was a sad moment that you know she was triggered, and I never did, understood did she, triggering. Did she reach out? to you afterwards and apologize I know she apologized to the audience but... she apologized to the audience not for what she did to me and they had no idea what happened when I walked off this you set. haven't heard from anyone from uh, yeah no a producer called and yesterday I was it was non-stop radio and television I was promoting the book I haven't had a chance to return the call but the producer did call you know, so, I mean, what, is this just, did they hate the president so much that you were the person, you, you've been a supporter of him, so they're coming at you? Well, you know, I certainly think that may be it. And, you know, I tried to answer the question, just yeah. like you would answer the questions. And I said, you know, it's another audience. It's the ability to at least talk about some of the good things that the president has done. And the problems that I talk about in Liars, Leakers, and Liberals, which is the corruption at the highest levels right. of the Department of Justice and the FBI. And I have hundreds of footnotes in my book. Uh, it's an easy read. I mean, don't get scared by the footnote comment. But, you know, I make it a clear, uh, you know, it's clear what happened. Read the book. They didn't want to know. I, I well, got a question for you. Uh, they're watching this over at ABC right now. If you were to look into camera one, what would you say to Whoopi Goldberg right now? You know, I guess I would say to Whoopi, you know, I, I've always liked you, Whoopi, and, and I don't understand where the anger comes from. I went to have a conversation, and I wasn't allowed to have a conversation, and I didn't deserve to be thrown out. I really, I, 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 we, we can't treat people like that. You just can't. We can disagree, but we need to be able to talk about it. Hmm. Dutch, have you ever thrown anyone off your set? No. <laughs> <laughs> when you ask someone to come on as a guest, I feel like you owe them the common courtesy because a book mm -hmm. tour is hard. You're going from place to place to place, <laughs> and no. you're trying to speak to their audiences, and you're saying yes to invitations, and you have to make choices as to what shows you're going to go on. And for them to treat you that way, you're my family. I'm sorry that you were treated that way. Well, and I think as a guest in someone's home, that's it's just what the it wrong is. way to treat someone. Yeah. It's not fair. Yeah, you're invited into their home, mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, to be thrown off like that was really... It was disheartening. Mm. America is better than this. America is the place where you have free speech. It, but what happened yesterday was a microcosm of what's happening yes. in the nation. Yes. And shut down and shut down. Yeah, we don't want to hear from you. Yep. All right. Uh, once again, the book, brand new. It's what everybody's talking about. Leakers, liars, and liberals. Judge Liars, me. leakers, and liberals. Leakers, liars, and liberals. <laughs> liars, liars, leakers, and liberals. <laughs> Not your fault. All right. Uh, all Thanks right. Thank you. Thank you so Congratulations much. on the book. I'm thank sure you. it's going to do even better now. Well, we'll see. thank you. <laughs> Everyone, go bye.